Hi kids, today we are going to continue with the lesson games we play. We have already learned the different kinds of games that children play and also about indoor and outdoor games. In this lesson we are going to learn more about them. Do you play any game similar to hopscotch? What do you call it? Draw the figure that you make to play the game in the space below. Now let us see what Sita has answered for this question. So Sita says she plays a game with her friends called follow the line. How do they play it? They draw lines as shown in the picture here on the ground and then each player has to walk along the line without stepping outside the line. The player who finishes the full path and reaches the end wins the game. This game is called follow the line. So this is the game that Sita plays with her friends. In your book, draw the game that you play with your friends that is similar to hopscotch. Do you play some games with your family members? Which games and with whom? Let us see what Sonu has to say for this question. So he says he plays flying kites with his father, Ludo with his mother, chess with his sister and hopscotch with his brother. Now in your notebook, you write down the names of your family members and the names of the games that you play with them. Do you know the name of any famous sports person in your area? If yes, write her or his name and the game with which she or he is associated. Now when we ask this question to Sonu, he said that he knows Rahul Dravid who plays cricket for our country. Sonu is from Bangalore and so is Rahul Dravid. Have you heard of Sanya Mirza? She also plays a ball game. Find out which one and write its name. Sanya Mirza plays tennis. Find out the answers for these questions by yourself and write them in your book. The games that we play with a ball are cricket, football, basketball, tennis and hockey. Also remember that hockey is the national game of India. Find out from the elders in your family or in the neighborhood which games did they play when they were children. So Sita asked the elders in her family to find out the games that they played when they were children. Chess, Kabaddi, Ludo and Marbles were some of the games that they had played. Now you can ask the elders in your family or in your neighborhood to find out the games they played when they were children and write them here. Which game do you like the most? Sita says she likes playing chess. Match the riddles with the pictures. Write the name of the game in the given space. A riddle is a statement that tells you about something without giving away the exact answer. The first riddle. It has no wings but it can fly. High high up in the sky. Now I think. Which thing has no wings but it can fly? Up in the sky. Kites have no wings but they can fly high high up in the sky. This riddle refers to the game flying kites. If you land on a snake, do not frown. In this game you go up and down. What do you use to go up and down? I use the ladder. Now which game has a snake and a ladder? I know that it is the board game snake and ladder. So I write snake and ladder. The next riddle, king Queen, Ace and Jack, 52 of them make a pack. 52 of them make a pack. A pack of playing cards has 52. It also has King, Queen, Ace and Jack. 
so I write playing cards. Small and colored are these glass balls. To win the game, you have to aim with them all. Now, which game has small and colored glass balls? I know that marbles are small and colored glass balls. Therefore, I know this game is marbles. On the board are squares, black and white. There is the king, the queen and the knight. Which board game has black and white squares? Chess has black and white squares. There is also the king, the queen and the knight. So I write chess. Fours and sixes, if you can get a century is sure I can bet. I think in which game can I score fours and sixes and also a century? It is the game of cricket. So I write cricket. Besides playing, what else do you do? Sita says, besides playing, she likes to read stories and paint pictures. Ask this question to yourself. Think about the answer. Besides playing, what else do you do? Write down your answer in your book. Besides their work, what else do your family members do? Color the pictures which show what your family members do in their free time. If you want to add more, you can write or draw in the blank spaces given below. So in Sita's family, her father likes to read, her mother likes to dance and her sister likes to collect stamps in their free time. In your book, you ask your family members what they do in their free time and color the appropriate pictures. With this, we come to the end of this lesson. In this lesson, we learned the different kinds of games that are played by children and adults.